Hi, I want to talk to you about how I'm experimenting a little bit with trying to generate some sort of passive income through monetizing one of my popular projects. Uh, I'm not an expert. I'm certainly not rich as a result, but the process has been really interesting and I hope others find find it useful uh, uh, um, when they see the process that I followed. So here we go. Okay, so some of you might know about a little project that's gathering quite a lot of interest at the minute. And it's to do with hacking payphones. And you can see it or see its progress um, in my previous videos. But yeah, it's all based around this particular project. And with any project, I like to write about them and uh, blog about them to sort of break down the process and explain what I'm doing and hopefully inspire others to do so. But because this particular project uh, it generated more interest than others, it actually pushed my uh, view count over the threshold that Google require in order to start placing ads. And out of the blue, I got this little email from them to say, would you like to enable ads on your blog? So I thought, OK, let's give it a go. So about five weeks ago, I enabled it um, after setting up my AdSense account with them and linking the two together, which wasn't the most smoothest of processes, I have to admit. But we got there in the end and I wrote another post about uh, about uh, my project and my new workshop. And as you can see, there were a few uh, ads down the side, which I thought was brilliant. So I just left that ticking over, um, but I also turned my attention to how else could I generate some sort of passive income from the work I'm doing. And uh, I was actually uh, browsing a teaching website, test.com, and I was able to package up some of the elements I was doing or using into sort of like an educational document. And I posted it online as well. And again, just left that running for about four or five weeks and sort of forgot about it, actually, because um, of other work and life in general. And I've recently come back to, to, to both those platforms, AdSense and Tez. And yeah, you can see the totals here. So the one in blue is the AdSense. So over the five weeks, I got £13.75 from the adverts. And the one on the right, in the lighter side there, I've earned £29.90 from the uh, uh, education documents that I've been selling for like 50p in a pound a piece. Which, uh, and that's after they've taken their slice, um, the platform's taken their commission. So actually, I've not done too badly. <coughs> so it's all about trying to... Um, look at ways to direct more traffic to my blog and the phone hacking project now has its own uh, name its own network and I did think about creating a new uh, website for it but I thought well I've already got a blog that's being monetized so why don't I just set up a separate page for the phone hacking project and um, just use that instead because that will already have or is already qualified for 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 Google's ads. Now, this is great, but I need to get more eyeballs on my page. So this month I'm experimenting a bit with stickers. So I've got good old fashioned stickers. And what I'm doing every uh, phone box we catalog or the volunteers go out and hunt out a, a new number for me, they will and I will um, place a little sticker in the phone booths so that um, so that uh, hopefully people will see the sticker, see the address and um, go online and uh, to find out more. And in the process, um, more ads will be delivered to more people. So that's the next step of this experiment, just to see how these stickers or how we can generate more visitors to particular pages of my blog. And uh, I'll let you know how we get on. Well, there you have it. 
interesting, isn't it? And it's one which I've learned quite a bit about. OK, the process wasn't the smoothest, certainly wasn't the easiest uh, to set up initially, but things are up and running now. And it'll be interesting to see how I can build on that by getting more people visiting my pages. But at the minute, this little experiment over five weeks, yeah, five weeks, has generated £43.65, which is a lot more than I initially thought. I thought it would be pennies, to be honest. But yeah, £43.65 isn't too bad, in my opinion, for a, for a little experiment like this. And it's something that I can then go and build on and see if I can't bump up the, the monthly average here. But I hope you find this useful uh, and I'll update you if I can further down the line as to how I'm getting on with directing more traffic my, uh, my way. OK, take care. Goodbye.